Oh yes, yes, how frightfully droll. Hey everybody, welcome to the beer review. My name is Jake. Uh, today we're going to be reviewing the Sierra Nevada Stout. I think this is the first American Stout that I've had. So it's going to be an adventure, so come along with me. That's an exact sound of this particular type of dolphin. Undiscovered by science. Oh, they name it after me one day. So who knows, let's try this. Let's crack it open. So, oh, fucking hell. Can you see this? Does this look like a bottle opener to you? I've used. Use the nose. I'm using the Chinese, the dorsal fin. It's a difficult one. Oh, fucking hell. I can hear it fizzing. I've opened it somewhere. This is embarrassing. Oh, that is the worst bottle opener. Never using that thing. I'm throwing that dolphin back in the ocean. Here's the Sierra Nevada Stout. So let's give it a smell. Oh, yeah. I think that's my catchphrase, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <coughs> <coughs> Breathing too many, too too much air particles. It smells very similar to a stout. They have such a distinctive flavour because it's such like a big, powerful taste and smell. So let's give it a sip. Yeah, so again, it's big. It's rich, it's bold, it's got that malty sweetness that you get from a stout. Um, many people obviously, the this, this stouts most commonly drunk are, are things like Guinness, and this is similar to Guinness. It's just got that, it's well, one, it's a lot stronger, this is 5.8%. It, it just sort of just tastes that little bit, I, I'm going to say sort of coarser, but in a good way. So it's a little bit more unrefined, a little bit more meaty, it just packs a bit more of a punch. Yeah. I believe I learned somewhere that you're supposed to pour stouts and porters really slowly sheer blackness really really dark and that's what you want in a stout really so good on them good on them they're, they're professionals so well done it smells great in the glass <coughs> sorry mum right Yeah, so this is just a fantastic beer. It's a stout that I could drink quite a lot of. I've, I could enjoy that. Don't down it. You sip it. Yeah, you're refined. We're not animals here. Yeah. Uh, this bottle cost me two pound thirty from Ales by Mail. Uh, if you haven't used Ales by Mail yet, I should you fucking use them because it delivers beer. You order it on your computer, smartphone, iPad, whatever you want, and it delivers it straight to your door. I always like their bottles. They 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 look like really small bottles, but I believe these actually contain about three hundred and fifty mil. So you actually get that twenty mil more than you get from your average bottle. I'm enjoying it very much. It slips down a tree. So yeah, it's it's got those. So an easy way to describe it, I think, has those characteristics of Guinness. So the the maltiness, the richness. But it doesn't have like the creaminess. This is coarser. It's a harder beer, and for me, it actually I actually prefer that. It's slightly drier. <laughs> How about a rating out of ten? I'm gonna give it seventeen out of ten. Seventeen out of ten. Fucking don't hate the player, hate the game. Because I'm I'm on a journey of discovery. I hope everyone's along on the ride for with me. But I've always wondered sort of what gives it its sort of distinctive flavour. And it is roasted, it, they usually roast barley, which is what gives it. So that's, I think that's what gives it its colour, so what gives it its flavour. So that's just something I didn't know. So very proud of that. And, and now you can actually, I can just appreciate that a bit more. Just got to know that a little bit more. Knowledge is power. The ignorance is bliss. Good now, look, I can, I'm starting to analyse things a bit more. I'm starting to be like, ooh, ah, ooh. Whereas before I was just like, ooh, ooh, ooh. Thanks for watching, I'm going to finish my beer in peace. So get out of my house. <laughs> Fuck. Um, yeah, so I'm going to finish my beer in peace. And uh, so here's to the next one. So it's goodbye from the dolphin. And it's see you later from me.